We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Oh my God! Great costume. I'm sorry. Costume. Well, um. Anyway, I didn't mean to frighten you. Uh Come from a planet a long way from here. The thing is, I've heard all about this thing that you do called, um, Christmas. And I, I wondered if I could kind of, um, ask you a few questions because there's a few things I don't quite understand. Sure, fire away. Well, it's about the birth of Jesus Christ. Oh, I see. I've heard about this Jesus. Um, so, he was born on the 25th of December, yeah? Well, actually, no, he was born in September, but they use December um, as his birthday. Well, no, actually. Um, Jesus' father is God. Okay, so who's his mum? Well, that was a lady called the Virgin Mary. So she was married to God? Well, actually, no, she was married to Joseph, who was a carpenter. Well, he, they didn't actually have sex, God and Mary. Um, she remained a virgin. So, how did she get pregnant then? Well, there was this angel called Gabriel who brought Mary the Holy Spirit. What? Gabriel got her drunk? No, uh, well, it, it's too complicated, Well. We'll cover that later. Wait a minute. So, she's pregnant with God's son and she's a virgin. And this has got nothing to do with the bloke in red. Oh, you humans are so confusing with all your stories. So, um, exactly where in Lapland was Jesus born? Lapland? Well... He wasn't actually born in Lapland. He was born in the Middle East in a town called Bethlehem. So Mary and Joseph lived in Bethlehem. And there wasn't any snow. OK, carry on. Well, no, actually, they lived in Nazareth, about 80 miles away. No, there wasn't any snow there. They're in a hot country. Oh, OK. I'll just let the snow go. So how come Jesus was born in Bethlehem? Well, Joseph and Mary, uh, the night before he was born, they made their way over there on a donkey. So, what you're saying is Mary, who's a virgin, and nine months pregnant with God's child, who she never had sex with, gets on a donkey with a husband, well, it might have been, and they travel 80 miles to another town so she can give birth to Jesus. Wow, it must have been some place where he was born if they went to all that trouble. Was he born in a palace then? Well, no, actually, he was born in a stable. Could they not get a hotel? They went to loads of hotels and inns, but all the innkeepers and hoteliers kept on turning her away. Phew! Well, all I can say is that wouldn't happen on my planet. In fact, I'm off home now. I think I've asked quite enough questions for one day. 
see ya.